This is KION News Channel 546 at 5. Look at this, our top story at five, a feud between restaurant owners and street vendors right by the Santa Cruz Beach boardwalk. It turns into a shoving match. A vendor's cart then gets knocked over. Thanks for being here for KION News at five o'clock. I'm Aaron Groff. Tonight we're learning more about this altercation and its connection to what can be sold in the city. KION's Drew Andre joins us live in Santa Cruz after speaking with those street vendors involved. Well, good evening, Aaron. Street vendors are long to set up shop along Beach Street here, but they do have to get a permit, which most of them have. However, the vendors say nearby restaurants are taking issue with them selling food in their territory. A months-long clash came to a head this weekend. A cell phone caught a restaurant owner pushing over this street vendor's hot dog cart. We take business out from them. That's the reason I think they get mad. Guillermia Blas sells merchandise right next to the woman who sells hot dogs and watched the whole encounter. The vendors say the neighboring Beach Street Pizza and Falafel Hut have been harassing them, and it escalated Saturday when one of the business owners confronted the street vendor. She doesn't speak English, she didn't hear well, so she started moving the car and uh, that's the time when he threw the car and they there start arguing. The vendor filed a police report and the businesses claim retaliation. Some of their outside furniture vandalized. Objectively investigate, turn it over to the district attorney and they will decide whether or not they'll prosecute. Chief Mills says vendors have to have permits to sell on Beach Street, which this vendor does have. Uh, the city has a requirement that they obtain a permit to vend a business license. And as long as they have that, um, we really can't do a whole lot with that. But it takes a separate permit from the health department to sell and cook food. The street vendor tells us she has not been approved for, meaning she's not allowed to sell the hot dogs. Today, the pizza shop is closed. We've reached out to the Falafel restaurant's owner to hear their side, but he has not gotten back to us. But the street vendors say they're fed up with the way they're being treated. That's the way we survive. That's the way we 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 need to feed our, my family. You know, I'm a single mom with my with four kids. Well, that's the way I work out. Like now, there is a GoFundMe that's been started to get enough funds for this street vendor to get the proper food cart for her to be able to sell food out here. Aaron, that's already raised more than four thousand dollars. We're live in Santa Cruz tonight. Drew Andre, KI1 News, Channel 546.